Hello guys, welcome to Microbiology classes. In the previous video, we have discussed about uh, microbial spoilage of food. In this unit, we have discussed about categories of foods. There are three types on the basis of nature of spoilage and we have discussed about causes and spoilage signs and some important food spoilage. In this video, we are going to discuss about spoilage of fruits. Usually fruits, they inhibit the growth of microbes until harvest. That means they prevent the growth of microorganisms until they harvest. And ripening of uh, fruits, we can sell walls of that fruits and uh, decreases the amount of antifungal antifungal means those are anti to fungal and the physical damage outside from outside this damage during harvest breaks outer layers of fruits which are protective the protective layers are that damaged and the next fruits have low, low ph fruits have low ph that means acid nature that inhibits most bacteria except acid tolerant positive lactobacilli and the molds are tolerant of acid conditions here fruits are not able to uh, inhibit the acid bacteria because they have that acid nature in this in that acid nature the acid bacteria can live molds example is the molds are tolerant of acid conditions are involved in spoilage of apples and pears example pencilium expansum here some some food some fruits and uh, the spoilage and causing microorganisms here first apples spoilage process is by fermentation uh, causing microorganism is canidia and the next bananas is storage rot and causing microorganism is colletotrichum and citrus green mold the causing microorganism is pencilium digitatum next comes spoilage of vegetables here spoilage of fruits that means fruits they stop usually they stop the growth of microorganisms until they harvest and ripening of fruits weakens the cell walls and reduces the amount of antifungal nature and the physical damage is the one cause and uh, fruits have low ph that inhibits the most bacteria except except uh, acid tolerant positive lactobacilli bacteria molds are tolerant of acid conditions and are involved in the spoilage of apples and pears here are some examples here